Hi, I'm Gordon White, the publisher of Truck Camper Magazine. Today we're going to take a look at a 2010 Adventurer 90 FWS. This is the same truck camper we took cross country for five months. Let's take a look. The Adventurer 90 FWS is a 9 foot 2 inch hard side non slide truck camper with a rear full dinette, rear kitchen, and mid wet bath layout. The driver's side features the electric core compartment, the 38 gallon fresh water fill, and two 5 gallon 20 pound propane tanks. The passenger side features a compartment for two Group 31 batteries, the outside shower, and an access panel for the DSi hot water heater. The sewer hose is stored in a tube under the side wing wall. The rear of the camper features an awning, ladder, a large storage compartment, an assist handle, and the most popular feature of the camper, the aluminum Comfort Step Bumper. The Comfort Step Bumper is very solid and as the name implies, comfortable to use. When we were ready to go, we simply put the step into travel position and the comfort step stayed in place. To access the dump facilities in the 90FWS, you first remove the top step and then lift the compartment door revealing the 19 gallon gray and 19 gallon black tank valves. There's also a long plastic storage tray. Stepping into the 2010 Adventure 90 FWS, you will see the straight rear kitchen and full booth dinette on the passenger side. For a non-slide camper, there was plenty of floor width for two adults and one cat. The straight rear kitchen features a double sink, counter space, and a three burner propane range and oven. We really like the ergonomics of the straight kitchen layout. Above the counter is plenty of storage and an optional microwave. Under the kitchen counter is the water heater switch and the battery and tank level monitor. Also under the counter is a large cabinet where we kept a small trash can. It was great to be able to keep our trash can under the sink just like we do at home. We also enjoyed the three drawers where we kept most of our kitchen utensils and supplies. The cabinet under the oven was a bit awkward but we certainly appreciated the additional space. The two-way, six-cubic-foot refrigerator is next to the range and microwave. Behind the refrigerator is a large storage closet. The rear full-booth dinette quickly converts into a bed by removing the cushions, lowering the table, and putting the cushions back into position to make a bed. The bed then quickly converts back into a dinette. One interesting feature about the full booth dinette in the 90FWS is how the table moves. When you want to make the bed, you simply unlatch the table and push the table down. Then when you want to restore your dinette table, you simply let go, latch it back in place, and there's your table. Under one side of the dinette is a large storage compartment. We also appreciated the space under the dinette table. We put our shoes there. Above the dinette is more storage and the optional MB Court CD DVD Sirius Radio Entertainment System. Above the entertainment system is a selector for the inside and outside speakers. Also on the passenger side is the mid wet bath with a fan, shower, light, cabinet with a mirror, sink, and a flush toilet. Although the bathroom was a bit short for me, I'm 6 foot 3, the wet bath was large for a camper and very usable on our trip. The overcab bedroom features plenty of storage on both sides of the very comfortable queen size bed. We kept most of our clothing in this cabinetry. Just look out for those reading lights, they can get kinda hot. On the passenger side there was an additional storage cabinet. The optional MB Court digital HDTV is on a swing out bracket for viewing in the overcab bedroom or in the kitchen and the very far end of the dinette. Well that's it for our video view of the 2010 Adventurer 90FWS. Thank you for watching Truck Camper Magazine.